You know, Katara might be a waterbender, but your tattoo artist is certainly not an ink bender because boy, did they mess this up. <laughs> it's so bad. It's so bad. The things I do at 1 a.m. on myself, lol. You know, the line work's not as bad as the other Avatar one, but still, like, on yourself, on your leg? Out of all places, how do you get the reach there? Practice makes perfect, I guess. Maybe you'll get it touched up later. Not mine, but I've known the artist for over 10 years. Practice has not made progress. Is this one that bad? The game is gonna test you. Never fold. Stay 10 toes down. It's not on you. In you. And what is in you, they can't take. This doesn't look terrible. The bird definitely could use a little bit of, of work, but I've seen, I've definitely seen worse. Little red, big bad tat. Uh huh. Okay. So is that is is that Kim Kardashian under the Red Riding Hood in a in a beautiful forest? Might I add, the flowers are really well done and nice. And the wolf. If this didn't have Kim Kardashian Red Riding Hood on it, it, it wouldn't be a horrible tattoo. But it is. Angel is unamused. Oh, that poor face. Oh my God. <laughs> it looks like a face you'd see in a newspaper comic. Moved, and I'm looking for a new artist. Found these. This looks like an eggplant on top of a mushroom. That does not look like a mushroom. That's not great. The angle is all off. You gotta show the angles. Okay, doggy print tattoo. I've been thinking about getting one of these with my puppy's paw print on it, but not whoever did this one, because this is not good. Not good at all. Is that a leaf, or is that a jalapeno? Like, I'm, I can't tell if it's a leaf or a pepper, you know? And I think this one would benefit being, you know, a color tattoo. And also maybe shaded? Because good lord, is the king supposed to be Vincent Price? Don't flame me in the comments or anything. I don't know who Vincent Price is, but this does not look like Elvis, I'll tell you that. Year three of my cousin tattooing. Want to tell him to stop ruining people's lives. Oh, God, that is so poor placed. They're not, that doesn't look good, first of all, but like on the back of the neck, just I don't feel like that's where those should go. I feel like if they were placed properly, they still would look really bad, but maybe not quite as bad. I don't know. Showtime. Here's to the past. They can kiss my ass. A, the S we all drew in elementary school and middle school, and then the dollar sign. Also, my is crooked under the, the, the cups of beer, and then Showtime tattooed on the back of the thighs. That is awful. This is white trash at its finest. Club foot, anyone? Ah! <laughs> ah! No, that's, oh my God. That is so bad. I mean, the rest of it's really bad too. Hell, even you, you didn't do the boobs right, but good Lord, the foot. And you got that on your forearm? Oh, dude, the more you look. All right, I'm looking. It's a rainbow giraffe. The giraffe is looking at me a little funny. His mouth is pretty small. What else is there to see? I'm not seeing anything. These are all from a well-known artist in town who has a regular loyal clientele and has been at it for years. Bro, who put a wig and makeup on Lord Voldemort and put it on that dude's arm? Where is the nose? Where is the nose? <laughs> That's so bad. Yeah, <laughs> kitchen. <laughs> this isn't Lightning McQueen. This is Lighting McDutch. Oh my god. What an awful a rendition. When your fresh tattoo looks like it's already gone through seven sessions of removal. That is a fresh tattoo? Dude, this is like the LaCroix of tattoos. It's like you drink it and you can kind of tell it's there, but only if you like think really hard about it, you know? Like looking at that, I mean, it, it looks like just barely. What's that foot doing? Ew. Ew, that's just kind of like weird and gross. Also, why is the, f is that what babies look like? Or is that just the tattoos, the tattoo artist's fault? <laughs> that's not good. You did the plaid really well, I'll give you that. Credit where credit's due. Ouch, Gaia no feet. Oh, Gaia, what happened to your legs? Why are they phased into each other? Are you a ghost? Are you a phantom? What happened to you? At first, I thought those were awful panthers, but upon closer inspection, they're supposed to be cobras. The, the top one looks like a cobra. The two on the on the sides do not. Do not look like cobras. Okay, so we got the, the, the Anubis eye. Is that what this is called? I don't remember. Um, and then, a, and then a, a terrible double helix DNA strand. 
this this person did not use a stencil or anything. Just just winged it. Just wang it. Starting to think I'm not gonna find a good tattoo artist in my area. Oh wow, it's the clown from it. <laughs> That's so poorly done. Like, oh god, I, I, I'm not even gonna touch this one. This one's just a little funky. You know, if the hands weren't so bad, I wouldn't think anything was really wrong with this one. Maybe it was just an artistic style choice, but the hands are terrible. They're so bad. The arms are a little long too. They're like a little elongated. Medusa looking diff. You know what? I'm, a, I'm, I'm gonna be honest, this one's fine. The lines are not straight, which is my only gripe about it. But with a tattoo like this, it's fine. It's really not a big deal. Local listing, I'd almost feel bad. I can't tell if it's the picture quality or if it's the tattoo because oh my God, does that look like sh It looks so bad. Maybe the worst one we've seen today. Very permanent makeup. Oh, you didn't, you didn't, you didn't. You tattooed, oh God, that's so bad. When I said that was the worst one, this is the worst one. John the Fisherman. John, what happened? This is what happens when you go on a boat by yourself. The artist has never seen a human face. It's true, the artist hasn't. This is horrible, this is really bad. I need to intervene on my cousin to tell him to stop ruining people's lives. First portrait done, work in progress. Yeah, a work in progress. Uh, I think it's a little less than a work in progress. I think you've already failed. I think you've already messed it up. Why the baby looked like that? Some pretty bad line work done by a studio and posted on their portfolio. Oh my God, that is horrible line work. I mean, all of it's pretty horrible, but the line work is just so terrible. Keep smiller, guys. Life still goes on. Keep smilling. Oh yes, smiller. I see it now. The the art is beautiful. The it's actually really well done. But smiller, come on, man. Look how they massacred my vault boy. <laughs> the vault boy mom says we have at home. Am I right, fellas? Ha <laughs> ha! OP was gloating that it only cost them a hundred bucks. I wouldn't pay a hundred bucks for that. I wouldn't pay anything for that. That's a horrible tattoo. That D20 is all sorts of messed up. How are you supposed to roll nat 20s with that? Oh, dude, you didn't. You didn't get a tattoo for the okay hand. That is horrible. Found on Tinder. Is that supposed to be headphones? At first glance, I thought it was a stethoscope. Yeah, I mean, earbuds, I think, <clears throat> but earbuds that goes into the word lyric, that's pretty not good. <laughs> really bad. All from a professional at a shop near me. I can't get over the chuck of black hair. That's a professional? I could literally recreate that on a piece of paper and then it would be better because it's not on someone's body. This one could be worse for sure. I'm not the biggest fan of it. At least the line work is, is not like all over the place. The lines are pretty even Steven. But the rest of it, uh, whatever. If you're gonna tattoo reality stars all over your body, then at least get a good artist to do it. Is this all on one person? The challenge. I don't know what the challenge is, but all of these, I can't even name a single celebrity. Maybe Kim Kardashian? The rest of them, I have no idea. These are horrible. Colored marker on wet paper. Is this tattooing or is this just bruising? Because like, this is gonna be a whole different conversation. Well, that side looks a little bit more like tattooing, but the front looks like bruising. I don't like this. My friend got this chili pepper tattoo on his thigh. Oh, dude, you got it. it you, you can't wear shorts anymore. You can only wear pants. Cause that just looks like a wiener sticking out of the bottom of your jorts. Also, why are you wearing jorts? It doesn't even look like a chili pepper. Like the flames make it look stupid. At least put some color on it. If you put some color in it, like make the pepper red or even green, probably green is better then it wouldn't look like a ween. But no, it looks like a big ol' wiener. This is my sister-in-law's first ever tattoo. She said her friend only charged her 50 bucks. Well, your friend overcharged her because this line work is terrible. The tattoo in theory would look really nice if it was done properly. Whatever this is, the arrow, it's like a nebula, but with arrows and the arrows are all sorts of messed up. Like, I don't even understand what they were going for here. Behold the power of the cross and stupidity. You did not. You did not get the entire cross tattooed on your back, your back of the neck, your head, and then Jesus looks, that's a horrible, horrible drawing of a person. This is the worst tattoo I have ever seen in my entire life. I was thinking of getting something done by this apprentice, but their line work and coloring is a huge hit or miss. Okay, yeah, line work not too great on the butterfly. Definitely not. Uh, <laughs> where the, where's the butterfly's legs, first of all? What the hell is this creature? 
I can't tell if it's supposed to be from Avatar or from Avatar, you know? Like, I have no idea what this is. And what is this? Is this supposed to be a Ghibli tattoo? If you're gonna get a Ghibli sleeve, at least get a good artist to do it. You mess, why does Totoro look like that? I just realized, why the hell does Totoro look like that? The Ponyos look not great, but better than some of the other things on here. And the Scarecrow looks awesome. Why is this so hit or miss? Someone I know. Oh, dude, that's so terrible. A barbell with the America? and it's being held for some reason this is the this is a terrible tattoo this local guy has been tattooing for 30 years how has he been tattooing for 30 years that i gotta know because that looks terrible he must just have a really dedicated community and like clientele base oh that dog oh that poor baby oh no <laughs> it's so bad and the flower the line art is really nice, but the shading just makes it look like a head of lettuce. Oh, die. All the comments were positive. Why? Why were all the comments positive? Because that does not look good. I'm, I'm glad they are, uh, I'm glad they're happy with, with, with it, but I could never. Like a kiss from a rose on the gray. That wolf is like one bad angle away from looking like the doge. The, the fur, did really well. The fur looks good, but the actual face? Nah, no. And the rest of it also? Nah, no. Any guesses as to what the frick this is? I see wings, but the rest of it? I couldn't tell you. I have no idea what this is, and I really don't want to find out. Some dude from my high school fresh out the pin offering his tattoo services. Here's one of his masterpieces. Why is the cat stanced up like that? Looks like one of them, like... <laughs> you put the little, like, things on the bottom of its feet, it could look like a rocking horse. Good lord, it's like the Sphinx stood up. This was from a shop in my area. Mutant ginger root? Oh. <laughs> what the hell? Oh god, so many hands. That thumb is not where it's supposed to be. I don't even, I can't even like, where does that thumb come from? I, I'm dumbfounded. I'm dumbfounded. What the hell? A friend's first tattoo. Uh-huh. The premise is cool. It's like a, like a pirate tattoo or a, a sailor tattoo. But the outer shading is just poorly done. Good lord. She's so excited her brother only charged her 30 pounds. Is that a Sharpie tattoo? Please tell me it's a Sharpie tattoo and it can be removed. Because that's terrible. Also, on the foot? 